Still searching for the first win of their 2015 campaign, the 0-2 BSU football team hosted the Winona State Warriors Saturday looking for a little home cooking at Chad Anderson Stadium. Tied at three in the third, Winona's Jack Nelson finds Allen May on the bubble screen and May does the rest, finding the end zone for the game's first touchdown. Warriors lead 10-3. Later, BSU trailing 13-10, Jordan Hine takes the snap. He lofts one to Jordan Deskowiak, who goes up over the would-be defender and hauls it in for the Beaver touchdown. BSU leads 17-13. Same score, just over six left in the third. Winona's Paul Preston takes the handoff, bounces outside and finds the end zone for the go-ahead score. Warriors lead 20 to 17. Then 55 seconds left in the game, Beavers trying for the tying field goal, but the Isaac Onarud attempt is blocked by Winona's Jeff Brown and Nikki Poiser, and that would be your final as they lose 20 to 17 on final, or excuse me, on Saturday. Here is head coach Jeff Tesh and running back Tahi Nomain after the game. We just got in a long yarded situation, fourth and long, and didn't really want to put that young kicker in that situation, but we had to. It was just too far to go on fourth down, and we just didn't get a, something, a good kick or a, a good hold or a something. He just never got it up in the air. Uh, man, it was a tough loss to swallow. I mean, we worked so hard to get to that point, and for the game to end on a block field goal, it was just real hard. There's a lot of season left, and uh, they're good kids. They'll work hard. Um, I know they're really hurting here losing these close games, but uh, their character hopefully has got to come through. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.